Hi, I'm Jonathan and welcome back to the Mobility Couch. Um, today I would like to introduce a new topic that was already touched in a previous episode and it's about in-service verification uh, for passenger cars and light commercial vehicles. So beginning of October 2023, the Commission adopted a new legal act um, about in-service verification and um, it supplements the regulation 2019-631 that describes the current CO2 fleet targets for the passenger cars and light vehicles. Um, In-service verification is a very interesting new legal act because it shall verify the in-use performance of vehicles in the market, vehicles in the field, with regards to CO2 and fuel consumption. The responsibility lies with the approval authority that granted the emission type approval. And for the conduct of the tests, on the other hand, the approval authority entrusts a technical service that was not uh, involved or not performing the type one type approval test. In service verification tests can either be tests on the chassis dynamometer, road load tests, so this means the verification of the uh, driving resistance or uh, dedicated physical or virtual testing methods. So thanks for watching. I hope it was interesting for you. Um, please like, share and comment um, and stay tuned for our next episode of Mobility Couch.